I was going to ask you, how does that look? Like, how did it look for you to start practicing and being confident? Because I think I want to, I want to go here, but yeah, like the whole, like, oh, that would just give me so, so much anxiety, but like, how would you define what confidence is? Okay. So we start implementing it and like practicing it, being confident, but what, what would what would be a definition you would put for confidence? Con to me, confidence is is a belief. It's a belief okay. that you have. It's a self belief. It's a self image that you have. And so the okay. confidence is a piece where I cannot see myself doing this. So therefore, I do not believe that I can accomplish these things. I do not. Oh, that's good. And so, well, in in the in like one of the big things transitions for me was reading this book, Psycho Cybernetics, by Dr. Maxwell. Okay, Maltz. yeah. And he mm -hmm. says, like, if you can't see it, you'll never achieve it. And so, mm -hmm. like, you want to know how? Like, we're, let's really break this down. You want to know how I was able to get to that point? I saw it here in my mind first, mm -hmm. in my brain. I visualized me going into these situations and feeling okay. Yes. And so, yes. This, uh, this that is makes how, me so excited. Because <laughs> how crazy is it? Like I tell my son, he's in sports. And I tell him all the time, you know, sports people, they visualize the plays. They visualize the yep. routines. They visualize mm -hmm. this. And their body, the subconscious memorizes it based off of what you see yes. in your mind. And so I saw myself going into these situations and being comfortable so many times in my mind that when I finally went into that situation, at first I felt like I came into it going, okay, this is going to be interesting. But yeah. my body had memorized what I was yep. doing because I saw it in my mind first and it just kicked in. It was, it was like a habit. And I walked right. into that situation very comfortable. And I was able to give people hugs and shake people's hands and be in because yeah. I saw myself doing it so many times. And the subconscious doesn't know the difference between fact or fiction. It's just memorizing Absolutely. What, what you feed it. And so that's how I got there. And it, it mm -hmm. wasn't a thing for me because because of that visualization work. I had done oh, so yeah. Much. I walked into it. So and like, powerful, right? Yeah, like yeah. I say, like for me, like my confidence visualization like thing. It's like me wearing a badass dress, right? Yes. <laughs> badass dress and walking through a crowd of people like down the middle with my head held high and just owning it. And, you know, I still have social anxiety at, at points, but like for the most, most of the time, it's like, okay, I need to go back to that feeling. Mm. How does that feel in my body? And like, and a lot of times that's what gets me through is visualizing it, practicing it, because what you're, what you're doing is practicing being in your imagination. So, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that podcast. If you did like comment and subscribe, comment your favorite part below. I would love to know that if you're looking to transform your life, if you're looking to up level your life. This is definitely the podcast for you. So we're sharing real transformative stories that will educate, inform, and inspire you. So definitely download us on your favorite podcast platform, and we will check you guys in the next episode.